Hi, hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is your boy No Mercy Gaming, and welcome back to my channel. So, guys, we are going to talk about the, the uh, new update with uh, Black Desert Mobile, and yes, it's Hadoom. So, a lot of newbies there that doesn't know how to farm properly in Hadoom yet. So, basically, when they start Hadoom, they just pick any map they want to farm. No, guys that is actually a backtrack for yourself so i do suggest you to first start in balenos or serendia and then if you have start on a specific map or in specific zone so for example this is the map of haddon which is the field map so i am pract practically uh, starting at Heidel Pass Gateway. So as you can see here guys, I am actually trying to max out the uh, knowledge for these um, mobs. Alright, so each mob there would be a max knowledge to level 4, 5, 6, 7. So that depends on the mobs itself. So how would you know or how would we know what mob should we farm? It's simple as easy peasy so here how it goes so for example you are going to have them so let's exit the Hadam first so for example you're going to Hadam yet so you are already in a spot then you want to go to Hadam uh, again so you want to go to the Hadam uh, uh, how do you call this, this the Hadum zone yes this is the Hadum zone and once you get there so you are going to look for a certain mob that actually gives knowledge gain so for example uh, beetle uh, this beetle doesn't give knowledge gain since it's already level max so there's no point to do that one so here example we have here the small m so let's click on that and after clicking on that we are going to find the small m in the map so for example here okay Wait for a moment guys, so here we have a small M, so again the knowledge for this one is a little bit scarce since small M is quite hard to distinguish but here are other perks for that. So you may actually try to farm multiple mobs or kill multiple mobs at the same time while farming others. So there it indicates in the map that these blue circles, those are the mobs that you are going to priorly hunt. Alright, so that's how you hunt on every zone. And after you maximize that one, so you, so let's just say you maximize the knowledge for a certain zone. So this one is already 100%. Then that time, you are going to move to a different zone in order for you to max other zones again. And as soon, and well, as soon as you give, get 100% on um map or for example in Serenja you get 100% that's the time you proceed to other uh, maps all right so again Hadoom farming is quite easy but most of us suck at this because we don't know this one yet so avoid doing or avoid changing to different zones uh, every time I suggest farm in a single zone and max it out then that's the time you move out to a different zone for you to maximize the knowledge and knowledge for Hadom is very important especially those CP and HP because that would help boost your character a lot so guys that is how simple Hadom farming works so I hope you like this video and like and subscribe see you next time goodbye